Well, Tom, we have a Fox 5 exclusive. Passengers at Atlanta's Hartsfield Jackson Airport take down a man after he tried to grab a police officer's gun. Those passengers saw what was happening and they sprang into action. Now, Fox 5's Morse Diggs joins us live with this exclusive story. This is clearly a case of passengers seeing something that's not right and them no, doing the something case. about it. Yes, uh, and you, we know from reports around the nation that police officers have been under attack. In this case, there was no encounter between the citizen and the officer. That makes it especially unsettling for the city cops. That is, those who know about it, they'll know about it now. There is no routine in this, this line of profession. The Hartsfield Jackson Airport police commander discusses the surprise attack on one of his officers right in the crowded terminal area. A man running at a good pace caught the cop from behind. He was a fairly good sized guy and he hit the officer at a full run. Uh, so when he hit him, he was, he was full speed right in the back. This guy was trying to get his gun. And that's what we heard. It certainly appears that way. And the officer at one point saw his hand on his gun. But, you know, we're trained in, in keeping our weapon. He was able to roll over on his side and maintain that weapon. And what happened next made the commander feel good, really good. In the chaos, several citizens came to the officer's aid. They were on the ground. They jumped on top and they, they got themselves between the officer and the suspect. They were able to separate him and hold him down. Now, that man was identified as Anthony Phillips. He's been charged with numerous felonies, including aggravated assault and attempting to get a weapon from a public official. Commander Hagen tells me he plans to honor those citizens who did not run, but came to his officer's aid. Live from Hartsville Jackson Airport, I'm Morse Diggs, Fox 5 yeah, News. That post 9-11 mentality there kicking in. Morse, thanks.